Hi, my loves. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. I hope that you're having a beautiful and amazing day. So, um, you guys, I already posted a message earlier today. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're returning, thank you so much for your continued love and support. You guys, personal readings are still closed, but if you would like to support the channel, please like, comment, subscribe, and share. Information for tips and donations can be found in the description box. So, I did a, a um, collective reading earlier. It was a little heavy. Um, definitely, you know, have the copycat energy out for sure. Um, but I wanted to um, see what's happening in love. Okay, so let's let me see. Let me try to tap in and find out what's happening in love. Spirit, what are the messages about love? Oh, two of cups, the will of fortune. Okay. <laughs> Let me see, y'all. I, I really did. Oh, my goodness. Okay, Will of Fortune and Love. Okay. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. Because I, I was really trying to tap out of that um, weird energy from earlier, that narcissistic energy. So, somebody... Um, hold on. I'm hearing a song. Hold on. Hold on. What is this? Spotlight. Backstage. 50,000 fans screaming in the rage, bodyguards and limousines, this is the way I see you in my dreams. Oh my goodness, that's, that's um, Usher Superstar. Oh my goodness. So someone, <laughs> someone is saying they'll be your groupie. Oh my goodness. Okay, so first of all, I'm getting two different things. For some of you, you have someone that's watching you. You could have a platform. In the, in the song, um, he says 50,000 fans screaming in a rage. Okay, so for some of you, if you have a platform, you could have 50,000 followers or even more. You don't have to. Um, this could be you or this could be someone else. So for some of you, you could be someone in the spotlight or have a platform, um, and someone could be watching you or someone who has a platform of following their on stage or whatever. They could be watching you, you or someone, one of you, I feel is, um, in the spotlight someone either okay either someone is like a secret admirer and they like you they're watching you or you have a person that you know okay spirit is showing me a lot of different stuff some of you there's a person that you know but they're watching you they're proud of you they're they're your number one fan oh what is happening here <laughs> oh <laughs> i like this okay so somebody somebody has a secret admirer oh seven of wands all right somebody may feel like it's difficult to get to you or they feel like um you you have protection i'm, I'm trying to see like um uh, <laughs> the song is playing in my head Yeah, he says paparazzi flash. So for for somebody for seriously for somebody here, you or someone, it may be difficult. It, it's it's not easy to get access to someone. So so yeah, the page of cups. Someone has a crush on you. Someone wants to reach out to you. Someone wants to send you a message. Okay, but I feel like something here is blocked. Somebody can't. It's possible that somebody can't communicate with you. Somebody may have an, you know, I channeled something like this a few weeks ago. And I was saying that for some of you, you may meet someone and they could be very like well off. And I was saying this person, they may have like a chef. They may have a driver. I was picking up the energy of a, a like a high profile type of person. Okay. That has nothing to do with how this person acts in their personal life though somebody here is a public figure they could be a celebrity an artist they they have a, a high profile this person may be someone who actually 
have security or maybe they need security. Okay. Um, but this person, I feel like they have a crush on you. It may really blow your mind that there is someone watching you. Someone has a crush on you. They want to. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> oh my goodness. The lovers is here. Someone, someone really wants to connect with you. Okay. Now for some of you, this could be someone from your past. They're watching you. Yeah. Somebody, somebody feels like right now they can't get to you. Wow. I feel like for somebody here, you've enlightened someone or this person is very, there's some, this part, somebody want, Oh, listen, somebody wants you 10 of Pentacles. They could be well off. This could be you or them. Somebody, I'm telling you, listen. I Okay, I get it. Somebody's career, someone's life, someone's image. It's, um, it's actually... It, it, it's actually creating like a, a, a blockage or some type of barrier or they feel like your life may cause some type of issue. Somebody is really holding back, but they want to come towards you. Oh my goodness. Spirit is just like, yeah, look, somebody here is not sure how to go towards a person because they feel like someone is a star, but someone is headed your way. This person lives at a distance. This person could be on the world wide web. This person may have a platform. This person could be wealthy, but someone, ha someone likes you. There's a secret admirer here. Somebody has a high profile. They like you. This person, you know, and they, they may not be, um, spirit is letting me know that some of you, you need to know, like they, they may not, um, so this is very specific for some of you. There's a person here who I think that they're well off. Okay. To be honest with you, this person may be well off, but they may not be the one that's really in the spotlight. This 10 of Pentacles is telling me this person may do something online. I'm hearing specific, this person may do something with real estate and I just heard e-commerce this person here. Wow. Okay. Spirit. Thank you. This is someone here who may do something online and they make a lot of money. This person is someone who is enlightened though. For some, I think this person, they may carry a healing like energy about themselves or they like to, maybe they watch people who are healers. This person could be a motivational speaker, a coach or something. You and this person may do something similar or it's a type of, it's a dynamic duo where the two of you Whatever you have and whatever they have, you, you both could share it. You may be the person that has a platform. Somebody here who, somebody here has a platform. And I think that the other one doesn't. Hmm. Take it however it resonates you guys. I mean, I'm getting very specific details right now. I'm going to be honest with you. I feel like for some of you, you could be someone, you know, I don't know if, if you, um, this is something about like social media content. I'm here. Social media. You could be a content manager. Uh, I mean, you could be on YouTube. You could be a vlogger. It's something. There's somebody here who has a platform and I do feel like it may be something on YouTube. There's another person though that is watching you, but there's, this is a person who, they also have their own following. They could actually be wealthy though. I don't know in the, the connection who may have the star status. Star status though, somebody here may have 50,000 followers. You could have an Instagram page with 50, 000, something, somebody has about 50,000 followers, but okay, let's just keep going. Somebody is like, listen, I'll be your groupie though. <laughs> If you're someone who like posts somebody like they wait for your post. I'm here. Somebody's like, I have my post notifications on for you. <laughs> this is so cute. Whoever this person is, though, they're actually a, a big deal, but they're shy. Oh, I'm shy, too. <laughs> oh, my goodness. This is so sweet. Somebody here is so somebody is shy.
I'm hearing the song by the group Shy, If I Ever Fall. Somebody said, if I ever fall in love again, I will be sure that the lady is a friend. Oh my God. Y'all, this may be like an actual musician. This person may sing, they may rap. They could be older than you because they, okay, so I'm I'm hearing Shy and Usher. Those are old school throwback R&B songs. This person could really like R&B music. That very specific message. Um, they don't have to be though. This person though, they may like old school R and B music. The Empress, and here's a page of swords. Oh my God! Look at this. I cannot. These are the cards that just fell. I promise. You have the Empress, the Emperor, the Ten of Cups, and the Page of Swords. There is somebody watching you. They see you as the empress or an emperor and somebody here thinks that the two of you will be perfect together. <laughs> and then we have the ace of pentacles here, the queen of cups. The, somebody is about to shoot their shot. I'm telling you, somebody here may be, um, I'm here. They're contemplating somebody, somebody wants to make an offer. You know, I'm going to be honest. I feel like th there's some kind of spiritual connection here. Somebody feels like someone is going through something. Somebody is juggling and they're holding back. There's something here about timing. Somebody is juggling. They're holding back because either someone feels like they don't want to be uh, uh, an interference to someone right now. What is this? Yeah. Somebody is now somebody is waiting for the right time. So somebody could be on tour right now or somebody could again I'm maybe I'm pulling in several different people because I just heard the word acquisition. Somebody, oh god, what is this? <laughs> you and somebody, okay, thank you, spirit. You and someone you may both have somewhat of a of a, a busy lifestyle, but I feel that um okay now I'm hearing the term digital nomad. You and somebody both may travel. I think that you both work online. You're both create these. This is two creators, but both of you are in the process of building something right now. One person may be traveling. But the two of you, you have access to one another. What? I feel like there, there's somebody here may be a musician, but somebody does something online. I don't know what it is. I don't know if someone is into um, trading, stocks, real estate, investing. I heard, um, I don't know. Somebody does something online and it makes a lot of, it makes a lot of money. Somebody could be a digital content creator. Like I said, someone could be a, a blogger, a vlogger or something. But I heard acquisition. So somebody here could do something on online. They could be in the middle of some type of business acquisition. They could be trying to buy a, a business. Somebody could be into real estate. But somebody, they're like, I'll be your groupie. You're my superstar. I, somebody is saying you're you're like they're your number one fan or they wish that you were their number one fan it's something this is two creators there's two creators coming together but i feel like whoever may be watching this i don't think that you know this is a secret admirer you don't know this person it's trying to come towards you. You don't know. <laughs> and I'll be your groovy, baby. And you are my super Yeah, what I say? Somebody's waiting for the right time. I'm here. This is mind over matter. Somebody knows that they have to get something done. Somebody has to finish something they have to complete something before they can have this brand new beginning but they know for a sure fact 
that your wish fulfillment. I don't know if this person has had a, for some, the way this person is coming through this reading with how they feel. It's like they're connected to you, but I don't feel like this is someone that you know personally. It's like this, this person, whatever you're doing, they like it a lot. And they're like, that's all I need to know. Somebody here likes the way that you think, the way that you speak. This isn't, this isn't sexual. This isn't like a voyeurism. Someone, no, this is someone who is, they're tapped into you. They, whatever you're doing, they like it. Somebody here is doing something though in healing and enlightenment, or there is something, it could be your music, whatever it is that you produce. It's something it's in, it's, um, okay. Somebody here has been going through a tough time, maybe with their business, um, going through some type of transition. Someone, like I said, they could be acquiring a bit or something like that. Somebody is, is watching an empress. Someone is watching a, 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 I think this, they're watching a feminine energy and th there's this, this masculine is watching this feminine and they, they get happiness. It's something about this empress is comforting. They feel like they, they're, they're seeing what they need to see. They're hearing what they need to hear. This is, this is a soul connection is what I'm picking up on. This is two people who are going to come together. It, it, for some of you, maybe this has already happened. These two people are somehow going to meet online, possibly on social media. And if these two people come together, I'm telling you right now, the connection is going to move really, really fast. Somebody here has been watching someone and they're like, that's the one. It almost, I have to be honest, it always, it almost feels like an arranged marriage. For some, maybe that's what it is. Maybe this is an arranged marriage for somebody. That's not everyone, but somebody here is an emperor. They, they have an empire. They're falling in love with, with somebody. The two of these people, they're not on the same. Like, when it comes to fame and fortune, they're not the same. But spiritually, they're they're on the same. They're in the same soul group, soul family, soul tribe. But somebody here does not know that they're being watched by someone who <laughs> who really likes them. Judgment, y'all listen. And the two of cups. Somebody has already decided that they want to go towards somebody. Wow. Wow. There's distance between these two people. I, I keep hearing this song playing in my head. And I know in the song Usher, he says something uh, I'm hearing in my head. Drove 12 hours, girl, just to see your pretty face one more time. Bought my ticket. I was first in line. This is a metaphor to show how I adore you. Baby, yeah. yeah, somebody here is like, listen, when I get done with this business deal, when I get done with this tour, when I get done, when I get done, I'm coming to you. So you guys, this, this, uh, <sighs> I've been channeling a lot and I'm sorry, but sometimes in messages, I can get 10 different situations for some of you. This is someone that you know. You're in, you could be in separation from someone and somebody is like, it's my final shot. Somebody wants to come towards you, but they're tied up in something right now. And I feel like it has something to do with business, with something legal, a contract. Like I said, somebody here has an empire. They're working on something, but they're like, listen, I'll drive 12 hours to see you. I'm your groupie. I'm, I'm watching you. I see you. So somebody can't see you right now because of distance. Somebody could even be in another country. Somebody could be in another country. Seriously. 
but they're watching you. So somebody here that has a platform, something that you're doing on social media, somebody is watching you. That's how they, they keep up with what you're doing. And, and the thing about it, they're proud of you. They like what they see. They feel like you're truly special. <laughs> In the song, what is he says? Your love is, is legendary to me, but, but keep your love. This is someone here who could possibly be considered a, a legend themselves, but they're saying your love is legendary. It's something about the way you, I, the way that the, the depth of this, it seems like somebody that you know, but I don't feel like a lot of you know this person. They know you, but you don't know them. You're one of a kind. This person is saying they don't make them like you're, you're the last of a dying breed. They don't make men or women like you anymore. I, somebody said, I want you. It's you. I'm, t I'm telling you, this is like, all right, somebody's like, listen, it's you. <laughs> all I need to do is get to you once I get to, you know what I'm saying right now? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Anybody who follows my channel, you guys know that I do not watch TV. I will, listen, I will sit down every now and then and watch a, a show or a movie. But I remember last year when everybody was talking about that movie, 365 Days. I actually watched that. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is like, listen, <laughs> I choose you and you, I'm going to make you fall in love with me. But I'm going to tell you right now because you, and you don't need to put it in my comments. This is not something that is toxic. I repeat, this is not something that is toxic. I'm not talking about some obsessive, possessive person. There is no negative cards out here. None. None. You don't see the three of swords out here. There is nothing out here. But there is no threes. There is nothing negative out here. This is someone here who has become captivated by someone. Someone has made a, a soul connection to a person. I don't know what the result will be here, but somebody is like, I have to see this through. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm telling there's nothing negative out here. There's no reason for somebody to try to make this reason, this reading negative. I don't feel anything negative and the cards don't suggest anything negative. This is someone here. It looks like falling in love or, or really ready to put their best foot forward to go get the person that they truly want to be with. But there is distance here. There are there is distance. There is. Finances, business. Status, community. But whoever this person is, they're saying. These are challenges, but these are not blockages. OK, they're, they're, it's different. These things are challenges, but this person is not saying that it's a blockage. OK, yeah, we live in two different places. That's a challenge, but it's not a blockage. We got money. We can be, we make money. We're creators. We, we can make this work. OK, and that's some of you need to understand the difference, especially those of you who feel like you're waiting on someone in separation. It's a difference in a person looking at challenges and choosing to block you out versus someone who sees challenges and they choose to fight for you. This is someone here who's saying, listen, I'll fight for this. Your love is legendary to me. I'll be your groupie. And what I feel is a person here who is a superstar. <laughs> wants to be somebody else's groupie that's what that's really what i'm getting here the person here with with perhaps the fame the fortune or whatever i'm gonna say the higher profile they're wanting to go towards somebody who may not be in the spotlight at all somebody here is looking for something real 
I heard that song. I think the group is called Sh Shy. It's an old school group. I don't want to say old school. like, <laughs> But the song is If I Ever. I think that's the call. Shy. It's If I Ever Fall in Love. Y'all, I know y'all know what I'm talking about. From my R&B lovers. They, in the song, you know, he says in the song, you know, the very first time that I saw your brown eyes, your lips said hello. And I said, hi, this is somebody that you have. I don't for some of you, you haven't met this person or you haven't seen them in a long time. Or this is a, a case of love at first sight. I'm not joking, y'all. I'm telling you, <laughs> this is a case of love at first sight. It seems like an arranged marriage. Like somebody here is like the very first time that I saw your brown eyes, your lips said hello. And I said, hi, I knew right then you were the one. You're more than just a phase. For some of you, this is a friend of yours for, Oh, y'all. I little, I just saw a, um, I just saw like a a TikTok couple. This could be two people who are close, close friends. Maybe you've collaborated together. You thought about collaborating together with this person. Somebody's like, I know I'm in love with you. Y'all, I swear to goodness. Like if I, I'm literally, I'm channeling, like I'm seeing there's a, a TikTok couple here. YouTube couple like somebody is like once I get done with whatever I'm doing I'm coming back to you because I've known from the very beginning that I was in love with you okay let's 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 go this is the kind of energy that I don't mind sitting in because it's really really sweet it is somebody here really cares about someone there's nothing negative here challenges are here but they're not blockages somebody here is saying I'm I'm willing to work through this. And I feel like somebody is trying to take care of things on the front end to make sure that once they get to you, they don't have to worry about issues. They, this person, again, public recognition, six of wands, someone here receives rewards and recognition that they, they, public figure possibly. But I don't think that this person is in their ego. They're not. I think that whatever this connection is, it's going to be successful. Four of Pentacles. Someone is holding on to the idea of being with you, but they are holding back. But somebody may be holding back right now because they're really focused on building something. For those of you, if this is someone that you know, someone that you know, they don't want to distract you right now, but they, they want to, Knight of Cups, they want to come in. Oh my God. For some of you, this could be someone you know. They want to come in and, and have a, a transformation or a rebirth. Someone from your, your past, or this could be a friend. Okay, this could be a best friend turned lover, whatever. Somebody is like, I want you to know that I've had a transformation or this is just someone right now who's going through a transformation. Yeah, exactly. Here we go. Somebody here is, is they're, they're laying low right now because they're going through a transformation. Someone could even be going through like a major awakening. It's you that they want. It's you that they want to celebrate with, but this is, this is hidden. It's a secret. It's sort of that it's, I'm hearing somebody say, well, what's the point really in me coming in to bother you right now? If I'm not, I'm not totally ready. Cause somebody is trying to acquire something. They're trying to plan something. Somebody is working on something. And that's okay. Because in the end, I mean, it, it's, it's best for both of you. Somebody could even be thinking about trying to relocate. Or they're wondering like, okay, what do I do if I need to, if you have to relocate, somebody is moving things around behind the scenes. <laughs> and the, the thing about it is the way that this person is willing to bet it all on you. That's what makes me think it could be someone, you know, because it's like, 
why would this person do all of this if they don't know if you are in a relationship or anything? I don't know, you guys. This this person, they may be someone who's really gifted or maybe just by watching you, they can sense that you're single. I don't think they care, though. This person, they're like, this is destined. The will, There's not a single negative card out here. The Wheel of Fortune, the King of Pentacles, this person is just like, listen, you're mine. King of Pentacles, King of Wands. What did I just say? This person's like, I don't care who else is there. I'm, t I'm telling you, you're, you're my girl. You're mine. Somebody <laughs> this person is into music. They are. Or they telepathically communicate with you a lot through music. Because the seven of swords is here could be deceit, somebody being trickery. But I'm going to tell you, as soon as I touch the card, I, I heard Drake say those other guys were practice. What's the name of that song? Girls Love Beyonce. Maybe I need to start sharing the songs. It's 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 um the Drake song Girls Love Beyonce is what I'm hearing. And it's funny because when I touch the car, it's like music plays. It's the weirdest thing that's happening right now. Whoever I'm tapping into, this could be someone who also you and this person could both be very spiritual. This is a spiritual connection. Because I'm telling you, when I touch the cars, music is playing. This person, whoever this is, you guys, you have somebody good coming in. I'm, I promise you. And I said this the other day in the love reading I did, maybe one or two. I told you, I said, your MVP, your most valuable player is coming in. Whoever this man is, they look, oh my God, look, queen of pentacles, king of pentacles. And I'm, I'm hearing the girls of Beyonce. It's like, oh, this person may know that you have other people watching you. They know that. And, and in the song, he says, you know, um, those other men are practice. And this ain't no time for acting. This ain't no time for games. He's saying this is no time for acting for games or uncertainty. This there's no time for locking your phone and not coming home. This is somebody here. I'm telling you, this person is either like they're in the industry, they're on the road or some somebody here is saying, listen, I don't want that. I, I want the girl next door. I want somebody low key. I don't want the, the games. I don't. I don't need a lock on my phone. Oh my God. Who is this? Now I'm, I'm hearing, um, and for some of you, you, you may not listen to this type of music for my viewers, <laughs> but now I'm hearing, um, Oh, what's that guy's name? Okay. The guy's name, it's Kevin Gates and um, what's the guy's name? Pusha T. And the song is called Trust. And in the song, he says, these women ain't sh shit, but oh God, y'all, I'm, I'm just going to say, <laughs> I'm just going to say, don't mean to offend anyone, but listen, just, just walk with me. And the song, he says, these women ain't shit, but hoes and tricks. But baby girl, you're different. Yeah, when you're not around. What does he say? When you're not around, I feel like something's missing. I know you keep it real. Never tell no lies. Yeah, somebody here. For some of you, you know this person. All right, yeah. I know there's a lot of songs. Usher, Superstar, Shy, If I Ever Fall In Love, Drake. Girls love Beyonce and Pusha T and Kevin Gates. Trust somebody here. Some of you, you do know this person and they have seen now that they can trust you, but they're working on something in the background. 
But in the end, it's you, it's, it's the two of you that they see. You're all they see. And again, I'm getting this energy of like arrangement. This person is too, in, for some of you, the person, this is what I'm picking up. They're too invested in you to not know you. This is like love at first sight. It is. Yeah. Somebody here is. Um, they're working some things out. If you know this person, you two live at a distance for sure. This person could be stuck in something. One of you is, is stuck. You're hung in something right now. But this person is like, you're my, 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 my light at the end of the tunnel. You're my light. Even though I'm, I'm somewhere else, I'm in a different country. I'm going through things. I'm working on business. I, somebody here could have even lost money. They're like, but still, when I see you, when I hear you, I, I get everything I need. If you know this person, this person has been betrayed by someone. It could be a business partner. It could be a lover. Because in the song, he says these, you know, you just need to li listen to the song if you want to. It is a rap song, you know, <laughs> and. um, But yeah, he's saying like, I, I trust you. Yeah, he's saying like in, in the song, he, he's like, I may. <laughs> I don't want to say it. I, I may get banned. <laughs> This is someone who's saying, I trust you with any and everything. I trust you with my money is what he's really saying. I trust you with my, my money. I, I trust you with everything. I'm going to find. Um, it's something about trust because. Even in the girls, somebody here has a, a, a thing about cell phones. Somebody works on their cell phone a lot. Y'all, I'm telling you, like, I'm, I'm in this vision right now. <laughs> I'm trying to walk you through it with me. There's something here about cell phones. Somebody is, is really trying to say. Yeah, they're in the spotlight. Or they make a lot of money. A lot of people want them. They're surrounded by a lot of people. But this person is saying, but I will be, I want to be committed to you. I knew this from the first time I met you. Let me work some things out. I'm, I'm trying to, I'm in my mind, I'm really trying to hear <sighs> whoever this is too, they're going to come in and it's like, they can, they can change your life. Th this person, they can come in and, and share a lot with you. But in the song, um, he says locked phones, past tense, past codes. We passed this past time, presidential Rolexes, both sexes. This person, whoever this is, listen, <laughs> they're like, I'm your, I am your groupie. This person is going to try to spoil you right, but it's not just about money. This person wants to spoil you because of your loyalty to them. Either they know that you're loyal and they realize that after being played in other situations or somebody's like, I can just read your spirit, your aura. I know that you won't betray me. And that's exactly what they're looking for. This person said, I'll trust you with my, I'll trust you with my assets. All of them. Yeah. This person, they're like, well, how, how did you learn to be so loyal? Okay. Um, somebody needed to hear this. I'm, I'm sorry. It's, yeah, here we go, though. King of Swords, Five of Wands, Three of Pentacles. I told you, this person is dealing with something with work right now. 
with money, with their finances, they're dealing with something and they're making, I'm here, they're making executive choices, decisions. <laughs> this person, they, somebody here has tunnel vision and they're trying to balance some things out before you come into this situation. Um, I'm hearing another song right now. This person um, is saying, I don't know who sings this song. So this, they're saying, since Sin City wasn't made for angels like you. Oh, I'm done. I'm done. I'm I'm done. I'm so done. Sin City wasn't made for angels like you. Somebody here is about to do what they have to do to create heaven on earth for you. Somebody knows that their environment is not conducive to the lifestyle that you would want. And they're making changes behind the scenes. Somebody knows that they're, this is yin and yang. You see it? You see it. The angel and the demon. This is dark. This is dark and light. His and hers. Somebody is like, I know that, listen, I, I have a history. I have a past. But I know you can love me through this. But this is not somebody who's coming in. Somebody here is doing work. This is not somebody who's coming in. This person, this person could have, um, yeah, th this person was blinded by something. They could have even been facing jail time or something like somebody went through something. Whether you know this person and they're a secret admirer or this is someone from your past. Some type of loss, some type of past regret. Somebody here has learned a lesson and they're just like, it's you. Nobody can love me like you. I can't trust other people the way that I can trust in you. I've made my decision. It's you, period. Reconciliation on the bottom of the deck. Some of you, this is someone that you know. <laughs> this person is set on you. That's why I, I keep I keep getting like arranged marriage. <laughs> Somebody has already like planned out everything. Take it how it resonates. In this this message, I'm picking up different groups. Okay, take it how it resonates. For some of you, this is someone you know. For some of you, it's not. For those of you, if you know this person, this person has pretty much like planned out your life. But they're doing something right now. They're working on something. For some of you, if it's not someone you know, they love at first sight. They may not have ever met you. This is, I'm seeing a situation here where somebody, if they haven't met you, the first time they meet you, they're going to lay out the red carpet for you. And they're not trying to bait you in with money. They're just trying to show you that, hey, for what you give me because your love is legendary, I'll be your groupie. Somebody's like, I need you. Not in a codependent way. It's the. Actually, Spirit said, no, they don't. This person does not need you. They don't need you at all. This person is captivated by the fact that it's you that they want. They've chosen you. Oh, mm. King of Cups. This person here says, I may be. Pretty emotionally stable and secure. But listen, I'm, I love you. Wow. Oh my God. Building a future. What did I tell you? This person is trying to acquire something. They want your, your love life to go to the next level. But I'm, this person, I feel like they're cleaning something up. But this person is in the middle of build. This person is building an empire, but they see you in their future. If you know this person, they annoy you. <laughs> they get on your nerves. But you offer them emotional support. 
that, that they, they can't really find anywhere else. In fact, they're, they're really not even going out looking for it anywhere else because to them, you are ecstasy. One second, I need to send a message. Yeah, sweet song. I told you, somebody here loves music. They made this person. I'm, let me say this too. Spirit just said this to me. This person may not be, if, if they're involved with music, they may not be an artist. However, they may be surrounded by other artists. Okay, so this could be someone... I don't know how this resonates with everyone. This could be someone here who does, um, I just, they could do videography. They could record videos. They could be a manager, a producer. This person themselves, they, their life may be high profile, but something about them, they're still in the background. I don't feel like they're the person that's on stage. You get what I'm saying? Like this person, they may be a producer or a, a manager or agent for someone. And it may not be music. They could just love music. But you're their sweet song. Remember the other day, if you watched my, one of my readings, other, I was saying this part, I kept hearing the song best part. And it's 1234 right now. One, two, three, four. Somebody feels like you're the best part. You're their safe place. And they want to court you because they there's a magnetic soul attraction between you. This part, somebody here is saying, like, I know <laughs> my lifestyle is not, it, it's not for you. I know it. But now that I am tapping into my higher self, I, I, t I will court you. If you want me to court you in order for me to have this ecstasy and this emotional support from you, I'll do it. Let me go and clear up some things in the background. This is somebody here who is pre preparing the right table for you because they've chosen you. Again, for somebody to be this invested in you, many of you, you know this person. If you don't know this person, they're coming in, making sure that they whatever offer they present to you, you cannot and you will not refuse it. Like that movie 365, this person. <laughs> and I'm seeing in the movie where the guy, when she introduces this man to her family and they say, so what do you do? He's like, I'm a gangster. Like this person, I'm telling you, whoever this is, they're just like, listen, my past ain't pretty. It's not. <laughs> I'm a beast. <laughs> but you're my beauty. And like I said, you annoy this, this person annoys you with, you're like, this person is like, I'll be your group. And you're like, you're right. <laughs> you're right. You're like all those other girls you talk to or all you do this. You, they're like, listen, I'm telling you, you're my safe place. I, it's you, your ecstasy to this person. Spirit just said poetic justice. Mm. I'm going to leave it there. You guys, this was so so sweet. I I was happy to tap into this energy for sure. I don't even know what to call this. It's so <laughs> it's so sweet. What is I'm I'm wait a minute. Um because I'm telling y'all this is somebody in the this is somebody in the industry because Now I'm getting Jay-Z, Beyonce, um, that song part two on the run because he says my past ain't pre my past ain't pretty, but my lady is. On the run, like who wants that perfect love story anyway? If loving you is a crime, then tell me why do I bring out the best in you? I hear sirens while we make love. Yeah, th this is you and this person. Like as the old people say, y'all come from two different sides of the tracks. <laughs> Beauty and the beast. But this is somebody here who is saying, listen. 
I'll make some changes for you. Because whatever you have, it's what they feel they need. Somebody's like, I, I'm, I'm done. I don't have to be a player. Somebody wants to, somebody wants to settle down. Just period. Somebody wants to settle, settle down. And I feel like in the background, they're doing what it takes to create the, the proper environment for you. Somebody has gone through an awakening. And they've had to close out some chapters, perhaps where they were extremely materialistic and all about the money. Somebody now is realizing that they have a soul made of twin flame. They have a magnetic soul connection to someone and they may be shy. Love may not be their thing. They don't really know how to go about doing this, but they want to make an offer. They're watching you right now. For some of you, this is someone that you know, but they don't really know how to present themselves to you. Because they perhaps they've never done that. Everybody, this is someone here who they're used to having groupies, but now they want to be your groupie. <laughs> they want to be your groupie, but they don't know what to do because they're used to the groupies coming towards them. Poor little Tink Tink. <laughs> You're gonna have to um if you choose if you connect with this person, they now I'm hearing music soul child. You're going to have to teach them how to love. You're going to have to show them the way to, to your heart and their heart. Yeah, there's girl. I'm so lost. Teach me how to love. Yeah, they, they're, they're wanting to tap into their emotions after some kind of awakening. Okay, I'm going to leave it here. <laughs> Super sweet. Oh, my goodness. You guys, invite me to the wedding, okay? Please invite me to the wedding, even especially if it's in another country. I'm there, okay? <laughs> and if this is, listen, I'm single. If you're watching me, email. Email me. It's in the description box. <laughs> it's in the description box. <laughs> Anyway, you guys, I love you all so much. <laughs> I love you guys. Um, always go within so that you never go without. I'm sending you all lots of peace, love, and light on your journey. Um, you guys, you deserve this love, okay? It, it, it feels good. It looks good. I, I hope, I want everyone to have this. So I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.